Bonjour! Morning guys. Um, so today I have some errands to run. I have a little bit of running around to do and I figured I would vlog, bring you guys along with me. And as you can see from the title of this video, right now I am in France. I'm actually in Paris and I told you on my Instagram I was going to be telling you all about why I'm here. So, okay. Basically... These birds are so loud right now, oh my goodness. So basically what the situation is, um, actually, hold on, <laughs> let me sit down. It's kind of hard to stand and talk and vlog and do all that at the same time. Um, all right, so like I was saying, I, as some of you know, I have been studying French for quite some time. I actually take a French class back at home and pretty much I've always wanted to study abroad ever since I was in high school really. I've been wanting to study abroad but um, you know how life goes. Everything doesn't always happen when you want them to so kind of had to put that dream on the back burner for a while and when I was here two years ago I told myself I really want to come back and stay for a while and be able to immerse myself in the language and the culture and all that so ever since then i've been planning and saving and figuring everything out logistically so i could kind of hit the pause button on my real life and be able to come over here and live in a french-speaking country so yeah that's what i did so i have class every day monday through friday and it's pretty much all day long and um then I just have Saturday and Sunday free. So the weekends are pretty much my only free time. Um, so it's been a lot, but it's been great. I've learned a lot since I've been here. And while I'm here, I am trying to speak as little English as possible. I'm trying to stay away from English news, English shows, just anything in English and only speak in French. Been here now a little over a week. We got here the week before last and it's been pretty good. The only thing that hasn't been very good is the weather. Like it's been super dreary and rainy and it was kind of depressing last week. So I'm really excited for today because it's supposed to be really nice today. It's supposed to be really, really sunny and um, warm. It's been kind of cold, so that's not been fun, but it's supposed to be a really good day today. And yeah, it's just been really nice to experience this with my family. We um, went to the Louvre on Wednesday. Today's Saturday, by the way. Went to the Louvre, we went to um, the Eiffel Tower, of course, went to just a bunch of different places, went around to the see the sights and everything like that. So that's been fun. And as you can see, I'm staying in an apartment. It's in a really cute neighborhood. I like it a lot. It's has it been the most quiet of times because right now the i think it's called the euro cup is going on so it's like the big soccer football football uh match so there's a lot of people in the streets partying cheering making a lot of noise so <laughs> it hasn't been very quiet but it hasn't been that bad it's actually kind of um pretty cool to see yeah but actually you know what let me show you guys the view from the back this is the view from the balcony and these are the just the backs of the other apartments I actually have a neighbor over here that likes to walk by his window naked a lot and yesterday I just happened to look out the window and I saw him like in his full glory everything was just all hanging out and I was like really bruh <laughs> But it's actually kind of funny, but yeah, so really cute Looking for The nail shop. I don't know if I'm going in the right direction. I know I'm on the right street, but I don't know if I am going the right way, so I might have to turn around But yeah, I have to go and get my nails done because I will show you but they look like I've been working on railroads my hands look a hot mess so they need to be done today um so yeah that's what i'm about to do now and then i have to go to fanac and get a tripod so i can do some videos make some videos while i'm here and all that good stuff so yeah i think i'm going in the right direction now at first i was going in the wrong direction <laughs> nail shop was full so i'm gonna go back 
in just a little bit when it dies down. But um, so right now I just came over here to uh, Gallery Lafayette. Well, I'm actually on, what is this? Boulevard Usman, Osman, I think. Um, and they're having like, it's really big sales season right now. They have like major, major deals. I'm not really planning on shopping, but I'll probably just browse, see what I can see. I'm not trying to end up in the poorhouse, so I probably won't buy anything today. But we'll see. If I find something that's really good, a really good deal, then I'll, I might get it. Beautiful day. double the price of what I would have paid at home so I'm just saying this better last the whole damn summer because it was a lot of money so <laughs> but I'm glad that my nails look decent now um, and I am headed to Fnac to get a tripod so it's right here on the corner Ooh. look at me following these people about to get hit Up and get some things for the house because our fridge is looking quite hainty right now so before I got back in I figured I'd stop and get some food found some vegan butter score their snack section um, isn't very extensive like back at home look this is pretty much their snack section right here may look like a lot but when you're used to 15 aisles of snacks at the supermarket it's not that much and they don't have my favorite chips so what are we gonna get today no snacks today i don't think that was a bit of a struggle um it seemed like everything i needed they were like hiding it in some obscure part of the market but I made it. The one thing I do want to tell you guys is that it is a very big difference in the way that you um, check out in the market. The cashiers, you don't have anyone to bag your stuff up. So not only do you have to put your food on the little conveyor belt, you also have to simultaneously bag it and then simultaneously get your money out at the same time because they just choop 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 they just <laughs> go so fast and they're just looking at you like you're crazy where you're scrambling trying to put everything in a bag and get your money out and stuff like that so yeah I'm ready to eat I haven't eaten all day and really I got something while I was out just something quick while I was down at San Lazar but I'm hungry again I've been walking around all day I feel like I've walked more in the past week than I've walked in the past year I'm just used to driving everywhere even if I'm going up the street I will hop in my car and ride to wherever I need to go so yeah I've been walking a lot I'll probably be looking a little anorexic by the end of this trip because of the amount of walking I do every day or maybe my cakes will be looking lifted and on point to the nose I don't know Hey guys, it is Thursday and I just got out of class. Well, not just got out of class. I've been here for like an hour. Um, and tonight I'm going to an event, a champagne event. Um, 
I was invited by someone I met when I was here the last time. I met her at, I had a meetup and she came and we met and she was cool. And um, so she invited me to this event tonight. So yeah, I'm gonna get ready to go to that in just a little bit. It's like, where's my phone? <laughs> I don't know what time it is. It's like 5.30 and yeah, it starts at, well, we're leaving to go there at eight, so. Yeah, but before that, I'm really hungry. I haven't eaten all day and I'm hungry as a hostage. So I'm about to make something to eat. So I'm gonna make this pizza. I made it and I put it on my Snapchat and a bunch of you asked me like, show us how to make that. So I'm making it today and I want to show you. And if I sound a little funny around the voice area, I've been sick all week, which has not been much fun, but yeah. I've been sick so my voice I feel like I sound like a man right now like my voice is extra deep for some reason <sighs> anyway but um first things first let me just tell you guys how I am slightly PO'd right now one of my nails has already broken and this expensive ass manicure well full set that I got and one of my nails already broke I wasn't even doing anything strenuous it just snapped off so kind of pissed about that and I have an event to go to tonight with a broken nail it's just not cute but life goes on anyway back to the pizza all right so I already have my chopped veggies my sliced tomato onion and um, mushrooms so now I'm gonna take my pizza crust and roll that out then I just like to curl up the edges a little bit. I'm gonna use this olive oil, put some of that on there. All right, now I'm gonna take my tomato sauce. Add the tomatoes. The onions. And the mushrooms. Then I'm using this Moroccan seasoning right here. Um, I've been using this as like my seasonal because this is <laughs> the closest thing I found to it here. So yeah, I've been using this and I really like it. It tastes really good. So I'm gonna sprinkle that on. Then the last step is the spinach. So I'm gonna go ahead and add the spinach. Pile that on top. I'm gonna put this in the oven. Let that bake. So yeah, guys, here is the pizza all done. Just got it out the oven. So yeah, I'm about to eat. I'm about to smash. I'll probably eat this whole thing. <laughs> No, I'm just joking, but um, yeah, I'm about to eat and then get myself together for tonight. 